Hi guys, so you've come on and you've caught me in the middle of um, making a seascape. Do, 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 do. And I saw that as soon as I was near... the end I would come on and sort of show you a bit of a process video see how we get on with that I got a thumbs down today I was like hmm what was that for <sighs> Some people don't like it when other people are nice to other people or something. It's weird. Anyway. So this is supposed to be reeds. I think I'm going to have to put some paste. Along the top of you. Looks like we can just do it in that place, in the zone. Well, that's kind of where I am at the minute. So I just thought I'd let you join me for half an hour or so. Don't need that anymore. I've used this tonight as well. The Nouveau Mousse that I got from... Um, Deja, and it's done really well. All these shiny bits that you can see all around here. Well, this is the Nouveau Mousse, and it really, really, really catches the light. It's cool. I love it. As a brightener, it's fantastic. Right. Um, more loo roll to cover the bottom, yeah. Thing is, I should have stuck these cabochons in last. I'm going to take these out. Because they should have been put in last anyway. But I wasn't in that time zone at that point. So I'm going to cover those like that. I need the... Uh, what have I done with the Mod Pod? I put it away. That was silly at me, wasn't it? Putting things away when I'm in the middle of using them. It's me trying to keep some order. Have you seen my desk? The desk looks like a bomb's gone off. Right, so I'm going to brush that. See, it's a bit rough there. I brush that down into place. That's okay. I'll paste that bit. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, I thought it'd be interesting to do a process video and see how I got on. See whether anyone actually likes me doing a process video. Put those back on. Right. I'm just going to get the heat gun out and pop you on pause because you don't want to listen to that. Okay, so it's dried a little bit. Not much. 
I'm going to go and get some green paint. And I've got this dark, like... Don't be afraid of it, it's only paint and stuff. <laughs> Mainly on there I want to cover because I, I haven't got any more toilet roll in here. And I don't want to go off and leave you for a long time because that would be rude. So I'm going to try and create here as like a marble effect. I can actually get any out of the... Oh dear. It's starting to run out of the lighter green. And get some more. Work with that for now. Leave the bottle upside down for a second. Find me a I think there's no stuff all over it. Ah. Just drag like that. Just drag like that. And drag like that. And drag. Clean the brush. And then drag the other colour. Try not to make mud. More of the light green. I'll just go away and dry this so I can second coat it. And I'll be back. Right, the time has come to put the cabochons back in. I've got this gel medium here. Then I'm going to use with... Where is it? There it is. My scoop. Well and truly stuck in. I'm gonna have this one down here. So 
turning this into like a some sort of a castle under the sea Prince's castle under the sea surrounded by mermaids and stuff Ah, dum dum dum. And next with words on it. Some of that Blue Nouveau mousse again. I'm just going to take that and go over and highlight. Make it look magical. Do, 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 Put redness on that. <sighs> Make it right down into those corners. This nouveau mousse is lush. How's it looking from up your end, guys? Looks really nice from down here, but I can't tell what it looks like from up there, obviously. Because <laughs> I'm down here. Somebody's dropped a coin into the sea, you see. I throw those sponges straight away because I, I pay 99p for like a big bag of them. So. Alright, I'm just going to, while I dry, I think what I'm looking for now is like a key. I should have. Key in here somewhere. There's a patina key. Could you imagine mermaids collecting things, can't you? So I'm putting stuff in their den. <laughs> Big kid really at heart. Mermaids have dens too, you know. Stick it down. Back in the water pot. Lid back on you. New pens away because we won't be using that again. Keep my glue pen out. Put that away. Oh, guys, I tell you, I'm so disorganised. I do need to 
turn her into a purple mermaid then. There's still some little bits of dye that haven't come out of it. I have a knee because she's kind of kneeling. So I was going to have a put sort of there. Kneeling against the wave sort of thing. Um, and I wanted to be blue, I believe. So yeah, we'll go with. Mr. Tim Holtz. We'll blue her up. Oh, seriously, if you guys could see the state of my desk, well, you can see just by here looking. <laughs> it's a mess. There's stuff everywhere. Right. That's not going to work. You have to unglue the glue. I hate that when you come into the end of a glue thing. And the glue inside starts to go tacky. It makes it harder and harder to get out of the nozzle. You can never use that last bit of glue. I suppose you could water it down a bit. Oh, that's a good idea, isn't it? Water down your glue when it gets to the last bit. Just so that you can use that last bit of glue and be really, really scrimpy. Quickly dry that down. Sorry about the noise, guys. Right, what do we think so far? I think it's missing some purplicious. Like a castle. And rock face. And some gold down there for sand. Some cabajons. Mermaid City, I'm calling this. But I think it needs some purple. I've got some purple metallic paint here, but I don't want to use paint, I don't think. I think what I want to use are the watercolour pastels. I can't wait for those Nuvo pens to come from um, Deja. Oh wow, look at that. It's better. Huh? Let's get some purple in the picture. What's wrong with this picture? There's no purple in this picture. You're probably looking at it thinking, oh, what has she done? Must be like a mystical effect coming from over here somewhere. I 
if I make that the pinnacle point and then push it out from there. Makes it look like this big cloud of purple smoke is coming this way. I think that's kind of enough. Problem with them little dobbers, you've got to use one for each colour. And definitely this colour. Well, that's it guys. I'll come on again tomorrow and show you the actual finished product, but that is what it looks like now. We shall see what it looks like tomorrow. I'm going to clean up and I will see you later. Bye!